well hey it's saturday and i have been home for the majority of the day i had a really bad migraine this afternoon like later on the afternoon did a little bit of laundry i still have one more load to um swap out but that's easy enough to do doyle's down there doing his thing and um yeah i had a migraine took some medication and took a little nap and then woke up and my dad had been texting me saying hey i need to come to your house and get something so anyway my dad and brother leave stuff here and i don't really understand why but whatever it's like every time my brother's in town or like when my dad is here he's like hey i need to come to your house and see if i got this thing over there i'm like okay <laughs> uh, needless to say he couldn't find the thing he needed so i don't know i don't know where it is he's losing his marbles whatever next week he's going to be 73 so i don't know what it's going on with him uh, but he thinks he left it at his brother's house which hopefully he left it there i don't really know so anyways um that's kind of what's going on here um it's just been a really um uh, slow going day for me because of the migraine situation i'm feeling a little bit better now um my dad and i did go to subway they had a deal i don't know if it's like in your area maybe it is like if you download the subway app um, and you order on the app, there is like a buy one, get one free for foot long. So I got a foot long, my dad got a foot long. I had half of my foot long, the rest is in the fridge. So I'll have that for like lunch or maybe even breakfast tomorrow. I don't know. Um, and then my dad got one too, cause he was over here and he's like, oh, well, why don't we just get it now? I, ha I don't have anything planned for dinner. I'm like, okay, well, whatever. He took his to go and um, which was just fine. And then I just sat and ate mine. And I was scrolling on Facebook and, or not Facebook, I'm sorry, on Instagram. And I saw a challenge. Um, I don't think it's based from Erin Condren, but um, I follow Erin Condren. So it's, the hashtag BLM planner challenge for next week. So um, I'm totally paraphrasing and I'm sorry if I'm gonna get some of the information wrong, but basically to share your spreads the week of the 8th through the 14th, sorry, I'm looking off to the side because there's my spread is over there and commemorating that week into Black Lives Matter. So if that's just using black in your planner or putting in other stickers um, that support Black Lives Matter and stuff like that. So that is what I'm doing. I actually filmed a plan with me, which I am going to try to get up tomorrow for you guys. So on Sunday, probably when this video is going up, because I'm this video is going to be pushed by the wayside, even though it's going to be really, really short. Um, but I filmed a plan with me, which I have not done in what, like a year, like it's been a long freaking time. Anyways, so I ripped up my planner from the week I already had planned and then I basically replanned it in a color scheme that for me will commemorate always in this planner. I do keep my planners every single year. I keep them as kind of like a memory keeping in a way. Um, I have since I got my first Erin Condren and um, I actually went online. I just went to Pinterest. I'm not selling stickers or anything, so you can just print your own stickers and use them in your planner. That is allowed. You just can't sell them. So I did take some images, print them out on some sticker paper. I actually need to buy normal sticker paper. I have like label paper, like sticker labels for like packages. <laughs> That's what I have. Um, and then I printed some stuff out and then I'm gonna put that in my planner as well. So um, yeah, so it's it's looking all right. So let me guys, let me give you guys a little sneak peek and um, I should have the plan with me video up before this one. So if I do, I'm gonna put it up in a card for you guys. So here's what my planner spread looks like so far. I am using black ink as well um, and all of that. So if you wanna see, all the sources that I used and everything like that, I will put that video, I'm sorry, up in a card and then everything in that video is like down in the show notes. So anyways, but yeah, love the way it came out. Um, and then I printed out some things. I might have to scale this down a little bit. I don't know. I wanted to kind of fill up, sorry, Ooh, stay. Um, I wanted to fill up like my margin that I never use over here and um, yeah, just go from there. So, and then maybe, you know, use it on some other days and stuff too. I'm not really sure, but um, I think this is important. It's important to me and um, I am going to utilize this in my planner. So, yeah. So anyways, that is, I think, going to be it for me today. Um, again, feeling better from the headache, but now I am like, 
I imported all my footage and now it's loading onto my desktop currently because it's like, I think like, I don't know, almost an hour worth of footage, which is usually the norm um, when I do a plan with me. And this one was kind of chatty, not super chatty, but kind of chatty. So yeah, I mean, I just kind of did a regular plan with me of like what I normally, you know, what I'm going to do this week. And I normally don't plan out my weeks publicly before they happen, but I just feel like for me personally, this is really important. And it's important for me to use my platform in the way that could resonate with some of my longtime viewers that really enjoy plan with me. So that being said, that'll be up on my channel very soon if it's not already. I think I've said that like eight times now. Sorry. <laughs> like, I'm just regurgitating information. Anyways, so yeah, I'm going to work on that tonight. It's about nine. Oh gosh, it's almost 10 o'clock. Maybe I won't work on it tonight. I don't know. I haven't fully decided yet. But maybe if I get a second wind, I will work on that tonight. And um, I'm going to work on fitting some of these um, in my planner as well because I really like them. And then the one over here, I went to Pinterest and like looked at images. So the one on the left hand side says uh, end police terror. So um, if some of you guys know I have lots of police officers in my life. And for me, the message is very clear. So, all right, well, Doyle and I are gonna go. I would tell, I would ask him to say hi, but he's he's dozed off into another dimension over there. So anyways, um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and um, I'll be back tomorrow for some more content. I'm actually gonna go uh, grocery shopping, and I think I'm gonna go see my mom for a little bit too, and hang out. So yeah, I mean, there's stuff going on. There's stuff going on, all the stuff I was gonna do today. It's now later. Oh, totally forgot to tell you guys. Um, the car situation. So I called this morning. Update you guys. Um, the car situation. I called this morning. They said yes, I need to get in, and getting in in two weeks probably isn't the best idea. So I am going in on Monday. They have an appointment at 8 a.m., but it's like a drop-off appointment, which basically means that they're gonna start working on the car in between other appointments. So I could stay there all day, but it's probably like not the best thing, especially with like COVID and all of that stuff too. So I did talk to my mom um, early this morning and she is gonna come with me and then drive me back home. And then once the car's ready to get picked up, then she'll drive me back to pick up my vehicle. So hopefully it's just an easy fix issue, all of that. They are also going to be repairing or not repairing, but doing whatever they need to do to the airbag situation. Um, there was a recall on that that I've had like a little paper on my fridge for like a month about. So I was like, well, it's time to do that too. So they're going to get that done as well, which will be good. But I would have gotten a loaner car, but they wanted to charge me like 40 bucks or plus tax a day. And I don't know how many days it's going to be there. And I'm like, you know what? I'll just have my mom drive me. <laughs> That's fine. That's fine. She's got nothing going on on Monday. On Tuesday, she's got something going on in the early morning, which is fine. But I'm working from home, so it's like not a big deal. I can be, I can be stuck at home for a couple days. Wednesday is the only day I have something that I like need my vehicle for in the morning. So, I mean, if worse comes to worse, I can have my mom come with me, or I can maybe just borrow her car for that Wednesday morning, if I need to. I don't think it's gonna come to that. I think they're gonna be done by then. But you, you, you just never know sometimes. So. Anyways, that is going to be it for me today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Sorry, it's just me rambling and telling you what I did or didn't do today, basically. Tomorrow will be way more exciting, I promise. I'll probably do a little grocery haul and show you guys what I got. Um, it's gonna be pretty minimal, but yeah, I, I, need, I need groceries. <laughs> I need, I need like fresh groceries. That's what I need, like fresh groceries. I have like snacks till the rest of the year, I swear. Um, I don't know, when COVID happened, I just like stress bought like all the things. So I, I'm like good on snacks for a long time, but I just need like fresh things. Like I'm, I'm really craving like, like a cold, like a green leaf salad. Like that just sounds like so, so good. Um, so yeah, I'm, I need, I need that kind of stuff you know what I mean like fresh veggies and fruit and like I don't know I'm just I'm craving it so bad right now so we're gonna make it happen y'all we're gonna make it happen tomorrow so anyway I'm gonna jet thanks for hanging out and I'm gonna see you tomorrow for another episode of the vlog bye guys well folks it's time to kick it old school uh, so you can feel cool <laughs> give it to me baby <laughs> Baby. <laughs>
yeah. 